Well, first, I wanted to thank my hats off to the RMAC for putting on a first class postseason tournament and also Coach Averson and uh, Regis University. They push us every time we play them and really try to bring out the best in us. And she's got a ta very talented group and has for a long time. So hats off to them on a great season. Uh, this means a lot. You know, our girls have worked very hard throughout the year to get to this point. The RMAC uh, conference championship means a great deal to our girls, and it's something we take a lot of pride in winning. And I'm really just happy the girls came out today and competed for 60 minutes. A little rough uh, second start to the half, but they persevered and, and uh, real proud of them for that. We knew Regis wasn't going to lay down. This is a rivalry game. You throw out the stats, you throw out the national rankings, and it's just who's going to compete for 60 minutes. So uh, I thought we got off to a really good start. Uh, we got down by a couple in the first few minutes of the game, but we pushed back. And then we battled to have a, I thought we had a great first half and a great ending. Then the second half came out a little slow for the first 10 minutes. Those first 10 minutes seemed like they took about 50 minutes to play and called a timeout, kind of rejuvenate them a little bit and they really pushed hard the last 15 minutes down the stretch. For all seven of them, I'm extremely proud of them. Many have been with us for uh, you know, all four years and they came here knowing they'd be ineligible for postseason play for the first two and they still came here. Uh, so to, to see a kid like Melissa who her freshman year got the game winning goal in overtime right on this field, get the MVP today of the tournament. Kids come a long way, all of our seniors have and they've really stuck together. We have great leadership and uh, they're a special group. Yeah, the kid's been uh, played in big time games all throughout her high school and club career and it's really translated well to her freshman year here. She's made the most of her opportunity and she's worked extremely hard um, in practice, outside of practice, and really 12 months out of the year to perfect her art craft. You know, I'm biased, but I believe she's the best goalie in the country and uh, she really showed that today. I thought the second half when we were here in March, uh, we kind of lost a lot of our energy coming out of halftime and our offense struggled a little bit and a team like Regis, you know, turnovers, they're going to execute and they're going to take advantage of and that's what they did. So we tried to stick to it a little different of a game plan today, but really we're emphasizing 60 minutes of lacrosse, two hours or what have you when you're out here and just try to play minute by minute and do the best we can. Uh, it feels great. I think we worked hard this season to get to where we are and I think there's a lot more for us in store this season. So. Um, on a lot of things, they pushed girls to worse angles to, for me to save them. Uh, we had a few defensive breakdowns, but uh, we fixed them for the next time. So I think that we, we tend to start off slow and then pick it up, and then second half we come out flat too, and I think we did a really good job of just keeping it throughout the whole game. Um, we thought a lot about last game I think and came out with a better mindset and came out a lot more prepared I think than last game so um it means a lot I mean being a freshman well the freshman of the year award that is different but you know being able to get a title like that is rewarding so um you know I just take it one play at a time there's not much more I can do other than be um really careful what I have presented with me at the time and just looking at what is in front of me and deciding from there. Um, it means a lot to us, you know, just like every other team, we put in a lot of work every day and we put in a lot of blood, sweat and tears sometimes. And it really, it's just really nice for us to see how much it pays off in the end when we work together and put in what we practice throughout the week. Yeah, I'm, momentum means everything. I think if you, sometimes it's hard when you watch a team get up. Um, and sometimes it's easy to get, to get deflated, but then once you get going and you get more confidence, it's easy to just keep building off of that more and more. Um, it's all situational. I think it depends on the fact that we had a little bit of comfort, we had a little bit of room, so we wanted to take the opportunity to just kind of slow things down, catch our breath a little bit since we had the chance to, and again, just look at what we had presented in front of us.